It has come up a lot lately where people wanted to embed their Google Calendar but not share all of the information that's on there because I don't necessarily want to see everybody seeing what's happening. So today I'm going to show you how you can embed your Google Calendar in ClickUp without showing all the information. Hi everybody, I'm Yvonne Hyman with AskEvie.com and I am a business efficiency consultant for digital entrepreneurs. And if you're ready to streamline, optimize and automate your business, you are perfectly right here. So hit the subscribe button and the bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. And today we are talking about embedding Google Calendar into ClickUp. Now hold on for a second. You can connect your calendar with ClickUp, dual syncing all of the things. But sometimes you don't want to do that. Sometimes you just want to embed a Google Calendar to let your VA know when you are available or not without sharing all the information. Am I, am I right? Or maybe you are renting a public space and you just want to let people know when it's available without showing all your renters information. I don't know. There are so many different variations that could be a use case for this. So let me show you how you can make that happen to embed your Google Calendar in ClickUp without sharing all of the information. Let's head on over to Google Calendar. That's where we are starting today. And let's just grab the Ask EV Biz Calendar. Cool. Settings and sharing. And we got to scroll down. And the first step is we need to make this calendar publicly visible. Yes, we are. Now clicking on see free and busy. That ensures that people that are not supposed to see all the information only see free and busy. Little pro tip. If you want people to see any information, you need to add them in here. That will allow you both things, publicly embedding it without everybody seeing the information, but allowing certain people to see the information. And you do again have settings in here that allow you to either just see only free and busy. That's the view we are using right now. See all the event details, make changes to the event or complete manage sharing and have the full access. So for your VA, you might actually want to give them access to see events and then another VA might just need to see free and busy. That is all up to you. And then what we need is all the way down here at the bottom, which is the embed link. This right here, the public URL embed link. Now you can use the full on embed code and plug that into your website too or wherever you might want to embed it. For click up, we only need the URL. And then let's head over to my sandbox right here. As you can see, I got an admin space set up here with the list and we'll add a view and it's an embed view. That's the one we're going to use and plug in that URL right in there and create. Sweet. Look, there it is. But Evie, all the information is there. It is because you were the owner of the calendar. Now let me show you the magic. The magic happens when you have a second ClickUp account that you invited to this list that is not you, that is not Yvonne at askev.com and has no access to this calendar. And then you look at the embed view and look, it only shows busy. That's it. You can click on it and you can see that there's an appointment from 4.30 to 4.50 or from 1 to 4, but you cannot get any more information than that. And that is because of the settings in here. Now, if I would take that email and add that in here, then suddenly you would see all of the information. That means you have the granular access capabilities like you would be straight up in your Google Calendar, but simply in here. You can see all of your appointments. Look at that. You even can, can go to more details. You can see everything you can in your regular Google Calendar with the possibility of your VA only seeing free and busy. And that's how you do it. Now, if you want to learn more about ClickUp and how to take your ClickUp from zero to hero, I just opened up my waitlist. So find the link in the description, sign up for the waitlist and come join me on my first round of ClickUp 101 Take Your ClickUp from Zero to Hero group intensive. I would love to see you there. Link is down in the description. And if you made it this far and you still haven't subscribed, what's going on? Go hit the subscribe button and the bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video.